Longtime resident Bill Butler attends most city council meetings. He thinks he has some good ideas about how to fix the budget. We have to get away from relying on sales tax money and go on into, for instance, real estate tax money. Butler was one of about 50 Tempe neighbors who came out to talk about the $22.4 million deficit. City officials explain the budget and the current situation. If we choose to do nothing about this, we're going to spend all our cash. Previously, the city had estimated the budget deficit to be only $12.4 million, but sales taxes in the first three months of the fiscal year show the deficit will be about $10 million greater than expected. This could mean a cut in services, according to city manager Charlie Meyer. We are looking for feedback on what services are important to people and we also have to use our judgment and we also have mechanisms where we do uh, customer satisfaction surveys in the community and ask people what's, what are the important things to them. That could mean big changes for citizens who use services like the parks and library. Ivan Smith goes to the Tempe Library. He worries about the changes that could happen. Well, it would you know, interfere with you know, the times I come. I'd have to check out, make sure it was a close one. They close the weekends or early hours or whatever. The city relies on people like Smith and Butler to help shape the city's future. Why did it come out tonight? <laughs> well, I've lived here 50 years. I guess I'm interested in the city. That was Jessica Andrews reporting in the newsroom, and Tempe is holding another forum tonight at 6. Check out Tempe.gov for more details.